magic of Christmas in our grotto. Ho, ho, ho. Entrance price includes a gift. I heard the dog was leaving little presents. Yeah. Brandy and a mince pie, is it, eh? And a carrot for Rudolph. Oh. <laughs> Talking of which, David's nose is better. Better than what? Well, he's having a few drinks in here last night, wasn't he? It was all right, stay. It wouldn't stop bleeding. No, never came in. Everything OK? Yeah, of course. And the truth? Well, David said he came to the pub last night, but where was he then? Because he was gone ages and he was acting all shifty today. Ah, oh, messing's up, and I? I've pushed him away. Tracy, I adore you, but you really need to stop all this. I mean, so she's probably gone to another pub, getting away from Pete. I mean, don't get all paranoid. <clears throat> yeah, you're right. Look, things like this can kill a marriage. Tell her, Tini. Oh, I know, OK, I'm a bad person. And I lost it yesterday, snapped at him for defending Layla. <sighs> I need to be a better friend and a better wife and stop driving myself mad over things that don't even exist. You have the perfect husband and wonderful friends. That's the truth, isn't it? The truth is, um... There are some things you might need to know. Have I lost her? No. What? No, no, I love you. I didn't know anything until she told me last night. I told you what? She said she loved me. <gasps> Come out here and face me. Merry Christmas! Ho, ho, ho! I said no, OK? I didn't know she was going to come back and tell me again today. All right, get out of here now, you tart. Someone's just been a little bit naughty, but it'll all be sorted in time for Christmas. It's telling the truth, OK? You are misunderstanding this whole situation. Yeah, you mess up your own marriage, so you try and steal mine, it's pretty clear. Nothing happened. It, it... Not a kiss, or... And I love you, back. We heard. Platonic? Sorry. Sorry to her! I still don't come first. Yes, you do, cos he said no. Yeah, and then got you in the grotto. To comfort her? I, I, you're my world, Trace. Please believe me. It's you that I love. Lock the door. Put the clothes sign up. Good, and then we'll talk. No, just me and Layla. We'll sort this alone. Well, you did the right thing bringing her to the surgery. Is finding her a foster family really the only choice? For now, yeah. Until she's properly house trained. It's really your only option. They'll take her in, find her a home she can be happy in. I know you've fallen for her, but your lifestyle, it, it just doesn't fit with a dog. OK. Well, tell them I'll pay, you know, for anything, if, if she needs medical treatment. Yeah, me too. We're still her dog dads. <laughs> Gonna say goodbye. <clears throat> bye bye, little one. Find the best forever home. Give her here before I start crying. Ooh. All my girls making me upset today. Hey, I had to tell Tracy the truth. I'm sorry. I know. I was just trying to be nice. Well, in my experience, never be too nice to your wife's very attractive friend. Oh, I need to fix it. Big gesture. I could propose to her again. Well, you've lost your wedding planner. Yeah. Tell me what to do. I hope we can sort it. That Trace is not murdering her. <laughs> 